Welcome back to my YouTube channel. We'll be seeing how test hooks are used in Playwright. So there are four different test hooks in Playwright. One is before all, after all, then we have before each and after each. We will be making use of hook in, in this particular test. Okay, so let me cut this out and use it test and we will write the describe block. Okay. Basic test, let me name this as okay. and put this test here. Okay, now I want to uh, take out this step because in each step we will be na navigating to uh, to the URL, right? To this application URL. So I don't want to again and again write this test. Okay. So let me add here. Hook here. Okay. It's before each. Right. So here, let's say it's a async. I will be taking out this step from here and put it here. Okay. So let's say if I have multiple set of tests, right? So if, with uh, every test, it will be navigating to the this particular URL. Okay. Let's see if it does or not. Let me run this test. Take two seconds. You see, it has passed. So now let me copy this test and deliberately mark this fail and let's see if it navigated to same URL or not. So let's say this as test two and let me make this fail. So suppose you say if I, want, I will give a, a wrong locator. One test should pass, one test should fail. But we are trying to see if it is navigating to the same URL or not. Completed one test failed, right? So, like this, you will get the results. Okay, so similarly, you can use after each, you can also use before or after all. So, uh, suppose after each condition, you want to perform, you want to take some screenshot or you want to perform any cleanup uh, activity, right? Or you have some prerequisite you want to set. Before uh, before all the tests, I I want X Y Z data, right? So you can use before all and after all conditions as well. That's all for this video.